सो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल मैं हूँ सुरबी इंडियन गर्ल इन यूरोप जैसा कि लास्ट वीडियो में हमने आपको बताया था कि हम लोग जो हैं वो अपना फर्स्ट अपार्टमेंट विजिट के लिए जा रहे हैं जर्मनी में हम लोग जर्मनी में रहते हैं पाँच साल से और जर्मनी और यूरोप से रिलेटेड बहुत सारे वीडियोज़ बनाते हैं आज इस वीडियो में हम आप लोगों को एक अपार्टमेंट जो कि हम खुद भी इंटरेस्टेड हैं खरीदने में उसका विजिट करवाएंगे आपको प्राइजेस के बारे में पता चलेगा प्लस यहाँ के अपार्टमेंट्स लाइक घर कैसे होते हैं उसके बारे में पता चलेगा किस तरीके की फैसिलिटीज मिलती हैं वो पता चलेगा और भी बहुत सारी इन्फॉर्मेशन होगी इस वीडियो में तो फिर मैं वेट करती हूँ हमारी एजेंट का वो आएगी और फिर हम लोगों को जो इस अपार्टमेंट का जो है वो टूअर देगी मुझे तो ऐसा लग रहा है दूसरा फाजिंग में आ चुके हैं थोड़ा और ओपन है दुकानें और हैं ये स्कूल है किंडर गार्डन जिमनाजी दीपक सी दिस ब्रिज दीपक को लगा था यहाँ पानी वानी होगा पर वो बच्चों का खेलने का एरिया है वहाँ ये जो एरिया है ये है ट्रूडरिंग जो कि म्यूनिक के अंदर ही है और सिटी सेंटर से मुश्किल से 15-20 मिनट की ड्राइव मान लो क्योंकि बीच में हाईवे पड़ता है जस्ट पीछे ये जो अपार्टमेंट हैं ये जो लोकेलिटी है इसके जस्ट पीछे रीम आर्किड इन मॉल है और काफ़ी सारी आईटी टी कंपनीज हैं कैप जेमनी है और भी हैं पीछे ही बहुत बड़ा ओपन एरिया है स्कूल है किंडर गार्डन है तो बड़ा अच्छा सा एरिया लग रहा है थोड़ा हैपनिंग सा ओके okay, तो आपने पूरा अपार्टमेंट तो देख ही लिया है अब हम बात करते हैं और डिटेल में जिसके बारे में आप लोग जानना चाहते हैं इतनी देर से सो लेट्स स्टार्ट दोज क्वेश्चन राइट नाउ द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन जो एवरीबॉडी वुड लाइक टू नो इज दैट हाउ बिग इज दिस अपार्टमेंट दिस अपार्टमेंट इज फिफ्टी सिक्स स्क्वायर मीटर्स Wow, that's good. Fifty-six mm-hmm. meters square is a quite a big apartment with three rooms. Exactly. Perfect. Exactly. And then moving on to the second question, what is this locality like? How would you describe mm. this area? So this area, um, as mentioned previous, is very very famous. So we are here in Messerstadt West. Mm-hmm. So it's mm-hmm. in the east of um, Munich. Before there was a huge airport, right? Mm-hmm. And now. It's um, we call it in German Wohnsiedlung. So there are a bunch of living space here. Mm-hmm. Uh, you have the shopping mall in front of you or in front of your door. You U-Bahn station is right there, bus station, and another very very important thing. There is this huge exhibition, the European wide biggest yeah. one. Mm-hmm. Plus you have a lots of IT companies here, mm-hmm. like Brain Lab. They're also very close by. Um yeah I talked also about the green mm-hmm. like it's a yes. very uh kind of a hiking spot right here as well but um so this is what I like when you come home you know you look also into yeah. the green but you can also for sport jogging or 
just lie down on the lake. There are two lakes over here, okay. very, very nice. Mm -hmm. It's for everyone. It's for younger people, uh, families, and uh, it's, it's kind of also protected mm -hmm. area uh, regarding nature. Okay. So even in future, um, the nature will remain here. Awesome. Yeah. So as she mentioned that, ki ye maine bhi dekha at the time, yahan par kafi sare IT companies are nearby, mall hai kafi bada, or the plus point ki U-Bahn station, matlab transportation aapke liye itna jada convenient hai if you want to sit, uh, travel to city center, mushkil se mushkil 10 se 15 minute lagte hai, aapko beech mein auto bahan hai, agar aapko drive karke bhi jana hai, to around 15 minute lagte hai, to you are well connected to the Munich and as well as to the other outer areas also. So, ये एक बहुत बड़ा एडवांटेज है म्यूनिक में अगर अपार्टमेंट देखने जाते हैं ना ये चीजें बड़ी मिसिंग होती हैं कि आपको पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट मॉल्स आईटी कंपनीज प्लस द ग्रीनरी ऑल यू गेट इन द नियर बाय एरियाज तो वो एक सब, सबसे बड़ा प्लस पॉइंट जो मुझे लगा यहां पर सो द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन पीपल विल आल्सो लाइक टू नो दैट हाउ ओल्ड इज दिस बिल्डिंग आई सी लॉट ऑफ लिविंग एरियाज नियर बाय आई सी लॉट ऑफ अपार्टमेंट्स सो ऑल दीस अपार्टमेंट्स वर कंस्ट्रक्टेड एट द सेम टाइम और देयर इज स्टिल कंस्ट्रक्शन गोइंग ऑन इन दिस एरिया so how how is that um there is still construction going on mm -hmm. which is great because this brings your property value up yes okay so everywhere where you see construction is actually good, good okay yeah. um that building was um established in 2003 okay so we have different ones there from the 90s mm -hmm. there are others from 2000 or 2010 so mm -hmm. it's really depending but usually when you go for such a big area you uh, create first which is close to the mall and yeah. then go all the way uh, down but uh, yeah it's 2003 which is awesome so like uh, if we would uh, compare this building to the mm -hmm. old buildings which we have a lot of in munich let's yeah. say 100 years and yeah. 150 years old building i have seen the prices are a little bit lower for those buildings but mm -hmm. there also have been a lot of problems in those buildings for mm -hmm. example there have been the heating pipe issues and all those things but uh, did you ever hear anything related to those kind of issues in the buildings which were constructed around 2000 and 2005? Because I believe that these buildings will have the better uh, construction uh, build quality, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and also I would say the old, older ones are also good. The mm -hmm. only thing that you have to be careful is, um, so when you buy a property, even if it's from the 50s and 60s, what I have too, they're not necessarily bad mm -hmm. you just have to check the protocols mm -hmm. you have to check when was the last renovation done yeah. what has to be done because some people find it on immobilians go wow it's just a great deal yes. they go there and they check the documents and they're like oh i understand why it's cheap because you're going to end up paying more right. right for repairs so a newer building yes it is better you have less maintenance but also so many properties which are older mm -hmm. and have also less maintenance you really it depends yeah. and um, as you know the munich or in general germany has these altbaus mm -hmm. the old buildings yeah. very famous yeah so everyone wants to live in the mm -hmm. altbau everyone wants to be there they want to pay this 2k net uh, mm -hmm. cold rent but uh, and this is what i believe the 50s 60s buildings gonna reach that point too mm -hmm. so the old altbau are protected from the government okay. so that means if anything happens there they do it right away oh, okay, okay? Mm -hmm. and then um such a building like 2003 which i say it's still new kind yes. of yeah. okay um you have less maintenance right mm -hmm. um el electrics are different than mm -hmm. the older ones yes. but um i i wouldn't say it's much much better because mm -hmm. Yes, this might be a little bit higher in price, a yeah, newer one. Yeah. The other one might be less, but on the older one you have, I would say, a little bit more air to go up, mm -hmm. which this includes as well. I'm yeah. talking here about 2018, 19, 20s, yeah. recently built. This is really very, very high in price. Okay. Yeah. So the next, next question to the guys who have been having the car, although it's very difficult to get the driving license here in Germany, but how about the parking? Like, is there uh, enough parking space nearby? Um, you have plenty of parking opportunities, I would yeah. say, like you found also pretty yeah. quick a parking uh, and you don't really need a garage over there, yes. especially for such a concept, mm -hmm. okay, uh, because you have the public transportation very exactly. close, yeah. um, but uh, there is no parking with this, but plenty outside. Yeah, but those who are having the car, it's, it's easy to find the parking yes. as we found it, it's just you can find the parking right on the street and there are there is a lot of place for the parking your car. Which exactly. brings me to the another question is that, how about the storage? Is there a keller room here? Yes, it is one in the basement. Usually apartments always come with a keller. Okay. Um, it's kind of mandatory. Mm -hmm. 
And from experience, when we also go downstairs, or oh, like now it's empty, but even if there is a tenant in there, the keller is empty. Oh, yeah. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, uh, we focus more on young professionals, yes, right? They don't yeah. need a lot of things, yeah. but there is always a keller here. Oh, that's always. great. Yeah. Which can always help you to keep some of the stuff in the keller you don't want to keep in the exactly. apartment. So, which is always a plus point to have the keller. There are a lot of people who would maybe like to buy the apartment from the investment point of mm -hmm. view and maybe buying the apartment and giving it to the rent mm -hmm. for the VAG and all. Mm -hmm. So, what would be the expected rent in this area? Mm -hmm. So, for such a concept, it always depends if you buy it for your own, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Or if you want to rent it out, okay. right? Investing. So. Here are three rooms, mm -hmm. all like each of them will be rented for approximately 800 euros, awesome. which is uh, mm -hmm. 2,400 euros cold. Okay. Plus the neighbor cost, mm -hmm. right? The additional cost. Mm -hmm. But it's not that's not that interesting for investors. Yeah. It's more about the cold rent. Yeah. Pretty awesome. 800 so with everything. And it's also because it's, um, um, we call it a Sondervermietungskonzept. Mm -hmm. So you have a renovated property, you have a furnished property. Okay, so you just need a suitcase to come over here and then oh, you're good to go. Yeah, that's and this great. is where you can charge. You know, imagine like uh, having a property which is giving you around 2,400 euros as a rent for every month, which makes a lot of sense on this specific price, which we'll, we, we will disclose it in the last of the video. Thanks a lot, Vanessa. You're welcome. See you Maybe soon. next time, yeah? So we'll see you. each other. Bye, guys. <sighs> हम लोग घर आ चुके हैं और आप लोग जिस चीज का वेट कर रहे थे कि उसका प्राइस क्या है तो वो थी अराउंड 600 के और अगर आप हमारे रेफरेंस से जाते हो तो आपको 1 ईयर का मेंटेनेंस फ्री होगा अभी हम कुछ और प्रॉपर्टीज जो हैं वो हमने शॉर्टलिस्ट करी है जो हम कमिंग वीक्स में जाएंगे और ऑफ कोर्स उसके भी वीडियोस बनाएंगे पर होपफुली आपको ये वीडियो और ये जो इंटरव्यू हम लोगों ने लिया प्लस ये जो फर्स्ट विजिट है वो अच्छा लगा हो and of course do not forget to like share and subscribe and milte hain next video mein it's around 600k and aapko best price milega to aap zarur hame mention kar dena agar aap iske through lete ho to details jo hai wo main description pe chhod deti hu